The 1930s were a particularly tumultuous decade in world history, and they started off with a bang, or more accurately, a crash. The Wall Street crash in October 1929 sent the world spiraling into a Great Depression that would last through most of the decade. The 1930s also saw the rise of fascism and dictatorships around the world. Francisco Franco, Mussolini, and of course, Adolf Hitler. To make matters worse, the 30s also had some pretty notable disasters. Widespread floods in China, devastating droughts in America, and of course, the explosion of the Hindenburg. But the 30s weren't all bad. Pluto was first discovered as the ninth planet in 1930, though that designation wouldn't last. The 30s also saw the debut of the first intercontinental airline flight, the Empire State Building, the Wizard of Oz, the establishment of Social Security, and perhaps most importantly, the development of the first chocolate chip cookie. But then, just as the 1930s came in with a bang, so would they go out with the sequel that nobody asked for, World War II, which broke out in Europe just as the decade came to a close. Getting elected president is an expensive business. Campaign costs add up. There are advertisements to make, travel expenses, convention costs, even bumper stickers. But where does all this money come from?